back for more, baby. Oh my god. That's that's bad. There he is. Oh, there he is, yeah. What's up, bro? Hey, man, you want to get the hell out of there? Hey, <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>! <laughs> Chip. Okay, we got a car in here, customer states, making a weird noise. Look at this beautiful Tacoma that just came in the dealership. Only 7,600 miles on it. And just look at the, wait. What the is this? What is, okay. Well, we'll just ignore that. Go on to the other key features like, is that drywall screws? Okay, well, we'll ignore that. And we'll go to, um, just look at that bull bar. Just so professional. What? What? Okay, yeah, never mind. It's fine. Hey, you think it's repairable? Yeah, that's no problem. Oh, little patch. So this is the exhaust off the car that had a misfire. Couldn't really figure out what it was, but uh, kind of wedge this open here. Oh, oh hey. No wonder your is misfiring. Somebody forgot to open the pipe up. Broken. I guess not. What you need? The car won't start. I keep pushing the brake and it's a push start, but it's not working. And he has two brakes. I don't know why he has two brakes for, man. How do you even get two brakes? Is that possible? What? Two but brakes. Which one do I push to start the car? This one. I just did that. Oh, right here. Wow. 
That's kind of tough. How do you get two brakes? Mmm. <laughs> Change your oil, boys and girls. Crude oil. Texas tea. It's upside down thick like a blizzard. I have a question. How are we breathing in cars? Cause like there's no air holes in a car and like you shut your doors. So like how does the oxygen like get in? And there's like no law to like open your window every five minutes. So like how do you breathe in a car? To the previous person who put yellow Loctite on this, I thank you because you never know when you need a step to get into the back of your truck. You know, we all have those days. Come on, is it gonna break free? Nope. This guy came in, check engine light on. Cylinder one misfire, okay? Come over here, you look. Oh, that's what the issue is. You're almost out of spark plug oil. Uh-huh. That one's good. Yep, that one's good. And that one's good. And that's how you check to make sure that your spark plugs are well oiled. So you simply remove the dashboard here, and then you go in here and go, yep, sure enough, cabin filter's dirty. Why would you put water? Why did you do that? Did you, you, you put water on it. just put water down. Are you? Excuse me. Um, hi. You know that this is really dangerous, right? What are you doing, dude? You know, you know that this is really not safe. You're gonna, you're gonna cause a big accident. Just beat it, will you? Seriously. Dude. Yeah. What are you? Why are you doing that? You know that they, they they it's not safe and they're gonna call they they're gonna call the, the cops. Give me as much gas as I can. Dude, it's not that serious. This if, is a little if, bit extreme. Seriously, if somebody if somebody throws a lit gas uh, match in here, it's gonna blow. He's going. Wait. He's just gonna drive off. Look, it's look at his oh splash. Oh my god! Oh my god! What is he doing, dude? I, we have to follow him. Dude, this is. Great, we're following. We have to. Look at that. Are you serious? Unbelievable. I mean, I. Where does he think he's going? I have no idea. How is he going to put that into his... 
No, he didn't! Yes, he totally did. No, he didn't! <laughs>